just want to say thank you because I was a competition winner from Bloomsbury Education uh, to win this bundle of goodies for a teacher. Um, obviously, rip the label off, the address label. Um, not that people would really care, actually. <laughs> this I've not opened it yet, I promise. Uh, tape's still on. So we're going to have a look now, okay? Oh, look at these. I don't know this is coming. What is this? What does it say? How to survive your first year in teaching. Um, I have... I think this is my 14th year of teaching, but I love a good post-it note and it's got lines on it, which is very cool. Um, so I'm going to do that for my to-do lists for the day. Love that. It's the first thing. Chocolates! They're going to last about 10 seconds. And then, yes, I am here, of course. <laughs> More post-it notes. Yes. More post-it notes. Research-based techniques. Oh, it's, it's your man, Ross McGill. Yeah, really big figure in education, wrote lots of good books. Uh, guide to questioning. Interesting, but again, love a post-it note. You've got this. Mr. T's ECT support. Now, to be honest with you, this <laughs> even this is for early career teachers, I feel like I could always do with a refresh. Uh, scrub up on my knowledge. I feel like, yeah, I feel like I actually need to read this again. <laughs> but thank you very much. That's you got this. Would be great actually. And I, 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 there's some big news and I'll, I'll sort of say why. Um, I'd love to read these and then do book reviews leading on from this. It might be tricky. Uh, and there's a big reason for that, but, um, it'd be a great idea if I could pull that off. How to survive your first year in teaching, Sue Cowley. You know, there's so much information in here. There's so many good chapters. Again, I think even though it's definitely not, as you can tell, from my grey beard and eye bags, um, that it's not my first year in teaching. However, it'd be great to read it um, and review it and probably learn from it, quite frankly. Because again, uh, Sue, Cal um, Sue Cowley, uh, absolute giant um, in the education world. This is the one <clears throat> I'm absolutely fascinated by, and this I'm definitely, um, I'm definitely going to read this first. I think, I think this is going to be huge for my CPD. I, I'm so excited. To be honest with you, this is the main reason why I'm so excited that I won this uh, prize, this giveaway, because I think this is this is going to be fascinating. It really is. Um, what every teacher needs to know by Jade Pierce. Um, just brilliant evidence research, classroom practices. I really, really need to read this. I really need to read this. In fact, I might. I was going to read another fiction book next, but actually, I think I think I need to read this. Um, again, there's a reason why not. Uh, well, why not? But why it might be hard. But this is why I really want to read. God, the light is really going all over the place. Apologies, guys. And then I'm fascinated, but I'm fascinated by this. The teacher, the teacher journal by Naomi Barker. Let's have a look at this. Bite-sized CPD and reflective activities for a successful school year. That is cool. Oh, interesting. It's like a week by week um, thing about how to um, sort of do CPD alongside your school year, essentially, for every week. Oh, that's brilliant. That's brilliant. I think that's a great idea, honestly. Oh, it's got like reflections. Oh, um, oh, this is fantastic. This is so good. I'm so pleased. I'm actually almost getting emotional. Seriously, I'm almost getting emotional looking at this because this is so... But I'm, I'm really genuinely excited by this. And then, of course, pen. Got to have a pen. Look, click your pen. Right. But what I'm going to try and do is not lend this pen out. I'm going to try and keep it. And it's going to be a nice reminder for me and I can use it for my teacher journal, oops, teacher journal and for my post-its. So thank you again, Bloomsbury. Uh, this has been more for teachers, I suppose, but uh, gives students a little window into the world of teaching, I guess, and how much of a teaching nerd I am. Please like and subscribe. Uh, teachers too. Thank you.